Assalamualaikum, I'm Kaylee Mary and welcome to my channel. As you can probably tell by the title, I'm doing another vlog today, so welcome to my vlog. So a while back, I think like probably in like November, I actually ordered something off of Mata Nisa. I ordered quite a few things actually. I don't really do clothing orders very often, like I don't purchase too much clothes, but I'm still kind of building up my modest wardrobe. Even though it's been a couple years, there's definitely still a few things that I could use. So yeah, so I just placed a small clothing order and I thought I would share that with you. So I did have this order actually sent to my parents' place, not to my place, because a lot of people have been stealing packages out of our building. I just didn't want to deal with all that and I just thought I would just have it sent to them and then I could pick it up whenever. And so yeah, I'm just gonna get into it. So whenever I order off of Modernisa, I always at least order like one hijab. I actually don't really have that many hijabs, even though it's been like two years. This one actually feels really nice. It feels like really soft. And it's just kind of like a green, but still kind of neutral in a way. Like this is a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I want to get something that's different colors because I usually wear like different beiges. So I thought I would go a little bit out of my comfort zone and get this green one. It feels nice and soft, so that's good. I'm not sure the material, but it's just kind of like a nice soft. So yeah, it does have a little bit of a pattern, if you guys can see up close. It's not like super noticeable though. This is just an under cap. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how this will be, but I need a, a new white one because if you wear a lot of white stuff, you know, like eventually they just don't look that great. They don't look as white anymore. And I've been wearing the same white one for a very long time. So I just went ahead and got a new, just a tube under cap. That's all it is. Now on to the actual clothing. Okay, this is just a jacket. It's actually really big. Oh no, I think it has a stain on it. Oh, I might be able to get that off. It looks like it's like a makeup, like a makeup stain. Hopefully I'll be able to get that off because returning things will probably be a nightmare. Yeah, this, it feels really like stretchy. I hope it actually ends up fitting because it is, it does look quite big, but it's just like a coat. This actually feels fairly warm. Okay. This is a big tunic. I don't know if it'll fit. It's actually really big. Yeah, it's just like a white tunic. I don't have any like white tunics, so I thought I would get one. It's very big. It was a one size. It was like a standard size, so I was kind of taking my chances on this, but even if it is a little bit big, I think it'll be okay. I tend to like things a little bit oversized anyways because I just find them a little bit more comfortable. So yeah, it is, it is big though. This one I'm actually really excited about. It is another tunic. It looks very like, I guess like dark academia. I love the color brown right now. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm sorry, I don't know. I can't, I don't have a viewfinder, so it's hard for me to see if you guys are seeing anything. It just looks, it looks very dark academia and it's neutral and honestly, everything here would be really good, like kind of paired up together. I think there'd be so many different options that like so many things could go well together. It's just very long and I think it'll be very modest. Obviously I'll have to wear something like a shirt underneath or something because this does go very low. But yeah, it's cute. Oh, this feels so soft. It's like, a, it, okay, so this next one, it's a set that I got. It's like a top, just like kind of like lounge clothes. It feels so soft. I wish you could feel this. So it's just like a brown shirt. Again, it's really long and it looks like it'll be quite modest as well. There's also a pair of pants as well. These will be good even just to wear like at home, like especially if I'm like filming and I just want to throw something on. These pants as well. I hope these fit properly because I have a hard time like, I think it's difficult to find pants that are actually modest, but this is the pant leg. I'm sorry, I don't know if I can hold this up properly, but like I said, I don't have a viewfinder, so it's hard for me to tell if you guys are actually seeing what I'm showing. I don't know, can you see? <laughs> it does look like it might be a little bit see-through, like just when I hold it up, so I might need to wear something underneath it, but honestly, it does feel super soft. I think it will pill quite easily though, but if things are like pilling, you can usually fix that pretty easily by even just taking like uh, like a dull razor and like shaving it off carefully of course it feels so soft but yeah i just i worry that this will pill other than that it's really cute this would go really well with maybe even like this one i don't know i would love to like mix and match a lot of these because i think they could go very well with each other marvin don't eat that hey stop the cat's trying to eat all the packages the entire time i've been filming so if you've heard a lot of rustling the cat's just been trying to eat all the packaging. That's kind of all that I had to share and the cat, the cat is still going at it. Okay. 
Anyways. I've decided to put off procrastinating and finally study Arabic. I haven't been super consistent with my studies, if I'm being honest. I think if maybe I had like an actual like structured class, it might be easier to motivate myself, but I'm just kind of like sort of teaching myself from resources I find online. So I think it's a little bit harder to stay motivated in that way. So to motivate myself, I got some popcorn and some tea ready because it's always good to have like a snack and something warm to drink when you're studying. I find that like super motivating for some reason. And then I also got myself dressed out of my pajamas. This is one of the outfits that I showed in the last clip. It's just like that two-piece set. It can be kind of see-through though, so you do have to wear something underneath. And just so that you know, it is kind of like plain. So that's why I kind of have my hijab over top, just to like make sure. Um, just if anyone was actually considering this, just I just want to be fully transparent. So I thought I would just update you on my day while I'm at it. Yeah, I've just been honestly having a hard time being consistent with studying arabic i don't know i don't know why like for a while like at the very start i was super consistent maybe that's just because i was like really excited and now i've just kind of like let it go a little bit i do find though now that i'm able to like listen to conversations and kind of like pick out words and kind of in a way figure out kind of what's being talked about like i'll be able to pick out like the noun and then like maybe like a verb and then i can like kind of determine what happened to the noun like i don't know if that makes sense here and there obviously i can pick out maybe like a few words in like conversations i don't know i never really thought i would get to that point even hoping that i can keep going maybe be able to actually like understand full conversations that would be great if someone's talking like really fast it's sometimes hard to to understand because i have to really like focus sometimes i'm sure there's words that i know that i'm just like missing just because like i'm not used to hearing conversations that often that's definitely something i have to work on and i definitely have to work on pronunciation my pronunciation is absolutely terrible that's kind of holding me back from trying to speak it because i know that a lot of the words that that I'm saying are just wrong and honestly it's a little bit because like I'm kind of embarrassed about like speaking like I don't know which I shouldn't be embarrassed like I don't really know much about the language like I just started learning obviously I'm not going to be an expert obviously I'm not going to be perfect So it is now Saturday evening and the plan was actually to vlog yesterday because I had like a whole bunch of errands to run. I was just kind of going to vlog my day, I guess. We were getting groceries, we were out getting necessities for the cat, all that kind of stuff. But it was kind of a hectic day, so I just didn't really get to vlog. We were really busy, we didn't really have that much time. Also, the stores were like insanely crowded. I think because it's like so close to Christmas, like a lot of people who celebrate Christmas are just trying to get all of their stuff done right now. And so yeah, it was very chaotic, so I didn't really feel like like, you know, whipping out a camera while there were so many people around and it was just crazy busy. All I was trying to do was like not run into people and just get my stuff done and that was it. As for today, I was also studying Arabic again. I studied Arabic like three times this week, which is an improvement because normally I only study it like once a week. And I think that first study session at the beginning of the week really helped. Like it was just a really good study day so i hope i can keep this up so i did kind of i guess like journal in arabic for the first time today i asked my husband to help me like a little bit with some of the grammar i would like to do that a little bit more regularly so this is kind of like what it looks like i just kind of did like a journal spread and then i just wrote basically and once i started writing i just wanted to write more i was so excited also this channel already reached a thousand subscribers it was literally just last week that i was thanking you guys for 500 subscribers so once again thank you for 1000 subscribers i know this vlog was kind of a little bit more relaxed i just kind of stayed in the apartment the whole time i'm hoping to be able to vlog a little bit more like doing fun activities outside and things like that like winter activities because there's going to be more winter activities in my city soon so stay tuned for those maybe like january maybe february i'm not sure exactly so if you made it to this far in the vlog i want to say thank you for watching and please make sure to like and subscribe